short thing is we're going to have to deal with more data yep. and more requirements on that data next year than we did this year. Just can't keep doing things the same way. It doesn't work. The single biggest question, problem, issue area in all of IT as a generalization has become how do I effectively create operations that scale? How do people manage thousands of boxes instead of tens of boxes? What you describe is a problem that every CIO that I talk to is dealing with. How do I continue to spend less on technology but get more business value from the spend? How do I manage a greater and greater set of resources with less people? How do I handle data growth without having to grow my operating expenses with that data? One of the things that I realized back in 2001, really earlier than that, was that over the course of the next decade, the growth in storage was not going to be driven by storage area networks and block data. It was going to be driven by unstructured data, digital content, things like video, images, graphics, documents, scientific data. These are data types that are all file-based. And as that file-based data became a larger and larger percentage of the overall storage market, it was going to create a significant problem for enterprises trying to manage this huge avalanche, this deluge of data. And so on one sense, I congratulate you for being a decade ahead of the rest of the world, because you did have the first scale-out architecture that was ever proven viable commercially. Um, but I guess the first comment is, boy, doesn't matter why, world seems to need scale out. This is a revolutionary change. Companies who have been selling traditional NAS products are going through fundamental transformation to move to this scale out world. This scale out NAS technology is the future of the storage industry. If the only way to solve problem is to add more boxes, more units, and then eventually, no matter how good we are as human beings, we reach a breaking point. The problem that you are describing is a problem that we find is acute with companies that deploy 10, 20, 50 anything. traditional NAS boxes yeah, sure. or traditional anything. As you scale your storage infrastructure, which as you say is inevitable, what you do as well is you scale your expense structure. Eight years ago, even more than eight years ago uh -huh. today, what we did was is we took a, a blank sheet of paper and said, if you were to design a storage infrastructure that was built to store not 10, not 100, but thousands of terabytes of information and do it in a seamless fashion where customers could buy what they need today and grow and scale effortlessly through 10, 100, 1,000 terabytes and beyond of storage capacity. What would that architecture look like? And what we essentially came up with was Scale Out NAS. What Scale Out NAS is, is a modular network attached storage architecture that enables you to seamlessly scale one single system from a few terabytes to petabytes, enabling you to get much more agility in your business, meaning being able to deploy storage on demand as you need it. Second big thing that you get out of scale out NAS architectures is you get simplicity. You get the ability to manage a very large system from one single console. You could have one administrator manage a thousand terabytes of storage effectively. Imagine going from three people to a fraction of one person and scaling your infrastructure 10x. That's the power of Isilon technology.